Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we have an exciting tutorial for all you Mac users out there. We'll be exploring how to run Android apps on your Mac using Genemotion, a powerful Android emulator. Whether you're an app developer, a mobile enthusiast, or simply curious about Android, this tutorial is for you. First, let's start by understanding what Genemotion is. Genemotion is an Android emulator designed for developers and users alike. It allows you to create and run virtual Android devices on your Mac, making it a versatile tool for testing, gaming, and much more. To download Genemotion, open any web browser and go to this link. You can also found download link in the video description. Now, click on Download for Mac OS. Wait a few moments. After download completed, open download folder and double click on it. Now, drag and drop Genemotion shell and Genemotion to application. Close this tab and open Launchpad. Here, you can see Genemotion shell and Genemotion icon. Now, open Genemotion. Click on Open. Here, you have to sign in. If you don't have any account, just click on Create Account Bellow to create an account. After giving login details, click on Next and choose Personal Use. Here, agree with terms and condition and click Next. Now, you have to create a virtual Android device, for that, Click on plus icon and choose any device. Click Next. Put RAM size and how many processor core you want to use. Click on Next Next and install. Wait a few moments until installation completed. After successfully install, click on Start. To allow camera access, click OK. We have successfully set up Android device on our Mac. Here, we can't find any Play Store. To activate Play Store, click on Open G Apps and click Agree. Click on Restart Now. After restart, we will get Play Store. Let's open Play Store and set up an account. I have already set up an account, now we can install any Android apps on our Mac. Let's try to install WhatsApp Messenger apps. Here, you can see, we have successfully installed WhatsApp. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more tech tutorials and insights.